Some time ago I made a film and wrote a blog about the different kinds of broody hens that I've come across uh, in my years of keeping chickens and the one that sort I didn't mention was what I call the cuckoo broody. In the case of chickles, she gets the pigeons to sit the eggs and I've had these two pigeons sitting in their house and unfortunately I didn't realise they weren't sitting on their own eggs until one day I noticed the male looking a bit uncomfortable and looked underneath him and he was on three hen's eggs and what happened was eventually chickles turned up and she batted them off the eggs, collected them all up, stuck herself in a corner of the pigeon house and I didn't think anything was going to happen because a pigeon sitting eggs can be a bit uneven and the mother was actually on five and now I've just looked under her and she's got a little chip so I'll see if I can get a bit nearer to her and we'll have a look. Here's the mother pigeon, she's actually made another nest and over on this side I have to move her. Oh Chickles you've done it again. If you, I will actually intercut a picture of Chickles as a young chick and you can tell by her face then exactly how she was going to turn out. It's not cold is he? Is he, is he warm enough? He wants his mummy. <laughs> The eggs stuck on those eggs. You're okay. We're going to take you in now. Come on, let's see. Now, isn't that better than being in a dove coat? And also, you had ants. I think that's a little baby Polish, so I'm not sure if any more of the eggs will hatch because, as I say, uneven sitting and also somebody's been adding to those eggs over time. They've been there quite a bit, so one is perfect, but more would be brilliant. Just do your best. Thanks for watching.